I'm here to show you how to do calculations in a query. So I have this database open that we worked with in Chapter 2. I go to Create. I use the query design. I'm going to work with the products. What I want to do is I want to find the price of each product uh, on here. So I'm going to add these fields. I double click on these. And what we have here when I run this, I want to determine the markup. What it means I have to add 50% of the cost to the cost, which means this will cost $24. Go back here into Design View. Two ways of doing this. What I'm going to do first, it says Query 1, I'm going to save it. Product Cost. You have to keep saving your queries to make them work. I'm going to use the Builder. It shows the Product Cost Query here. These are the fields. So what we do, it's Cost times markup percent. We could click on that little times here or use the keyboard. Whichever is easier. Plus cost. We say OK. I press the enter key now. What it's saying is expression 1. You, that is what is the new field is going to be. What I do, I just double click on the expression 1. Leave the colon. I'm going to call this sales price. Don't put spaces in the field. Press the enter key. Run the query. It's showing the prices here. I always say keep running, going back and forth. Makes it easier. I go back into the design view. What I want to know now, I want to know what the tax is. So I'm going to use this builder again. If you don't save, it's not going to show this new field. So I'm going to save the query. Click on the builder. It's showing sales price here. Um, and here. So what this is, um, sales price times, let's say our tax is 6%. We say OK. We hit the Enter key. Double click on here. Call it tax. Enter key run the query showing the tax here we want to make this look like currency we right click inside the column any place left click on properties format I get the letter C for currency type in the two decimal points here close this out last field I want to do is called total price I want to add the tax and the sales price together um, you can do this in another way. You can type the field in. I'll save the query. I'm going to type in the field name first. Total price. Type in the colon. That separates it from the fields. And what it is, it's sales price plus tax. You don't have to type any brackets. They will appear afterwards. You get one letter wrong, you're going to get errors. I run the query. Showing the total price here. Now let's say I want total price to show up here. It's formatted OK. All I do is right click in here, left click on properties, caption, total space price. And if I want to play it safe, I can make a currency two decimal points. Run the query again. We have it there. We can make that look like a percent. You want to make these wider. Double click on the lines here. It shows all the stuff here. So that is doing some calculations in a query.